Hi everyone, welcome to Narej Technologies. This is Srinivas. In this session, so we are going to discuss one logical program in C. So, that is how to print Fibonacci series right using C language syntax. Here is a concept of printing the Fibonacci series. So, what is the easy way of printing Fibonacci series? So, first of all, what is that Fibonacci series? See, for example, here series we will see is a 0 and 1 and add these two subsequent values if you add right 0 and 1 is the next two next number next element and 1 plus 1 is a 2, 1 plus 2 is a 3, 2 plus 3 is a 5, 3 plus 5 is a 8, 5 plus 8 is a 13. This is the Fibonacci series. Now, how to write the program for this? Right, generally how they will ask means what print n elements in the series, first n elements in the Fibonacci series. So, here it is the easiest way. So, here it is. So, directly so I am starting from the main function. So, first we need to ask the limit int n. So, means printf enter limit how many how many numbers how many elements we need to print in the Fibonacci series and here it is enter limit and they will give that n value n value so that we are reading is a percentage d n see just consider n value n value is 7. So, first take 2 elements nothing but first 2 numbers first 2 elements in the series into variables a a equals to 0 b equals to 1 and c. So, one like a temporary variable always we need to print that a value a value. So, here we are repeating the loop. So, i value starts from 1 to how many elements you need to print in the series those many times you have to repeat the loop. So, i value starts from 1 i is less than or equals to n i plus plus. First of all directly print a value print f percentage d is a print a value. So, what is that a value initially we took 0. So, in the output in the output first it will print 0. So, here a value is 0 b value is 1 and c is equals to. So, first what operation we have to perform means just add a and b and store the value into c add a and b a plus b and the value we are storing into c. See look at this the value a value 0 is a b value 1 0 plus 1 is a 1 will be stored into c. So, after that after printing 0 the next number is a b value we should store into a and c value we should store into b this process will continue this process look at this here it is the b value we are storing we are storing into a and c value we are storing into b. So, this is the process right use it to print that Fibonacci series see next time. So, i value become 1. So, 1 is less than or equals to 7 condition true it will print that a value see now look at this whenever you are placing b value here a value is 1 and c value into b means what it is also 1. Now, look at this if you print a value what is that a value second iteration 1 it will print is nothing but 1. Next here it is the same iteration if we need to add a plus b the value will be stored into c is a plus b 1 plus 1 the value will be stored into c after that b value we are storing into a c value we are storing into b first b value we are storing into a what is it b value 1 and c value we are storing into b it is a 2 and next number we are printing what is that next number in the series a value we are printing always. So, this process will continue now observe 1 plus 2 c value is 3 next b value will be stored into a what is that b value is 2 and what is that c value is 3. So, next number in the series 2 it will print next to 2 plus 3 is a 5 and next same story 3 will come to here and 5 will come to here and it will print 3 
and next 3 plus 5 is a 8 same again 5 will come to here and 8 will come to here 8 here it is a 5 plus 8 is value is a 13 next 8 will come to here 13 will come to here so like that it will go so in the series is we are looking for first 7 elements see these are the first 7 elements 2 3 5 8 this is how to print n elements in the Fibonacci series program using C language syntax. Okay? So, hope you understood. For more videos, please subscribe to Narayshati channel. Thank you. Thank you all.